Hey there, BZ people, and welcome to another episode of Subnautica. And on this episode, we are going to spend the first part of it building a base. Uh, decided I'm going to build it over by Life Pod 3, I think is the area. Um, and we are going to try to um, obviously build that base. Because I'm all about that base. About that base. Ooh, let's get some light in here. Uh, then we're going to go explore the cave system near Life Pod 3. See if we can't find some more diamond. Um, so part of what we're going to need to make our dreams come true, as I... Where did it go? Uh, we're going to need a lot more titanium. And we did swim right past this thing, which is what we're going for. Uh, we got some titanium in here, so let's grab some of that, and we probably aren't going to need alien tablets for a while. Um, we'll leave some gold here, and we'll try and fill up the rest of our inventory with titanium, which I th think there's some titanium down here? Yes, there is. Is it enough to fill up an in inventory? Two pieces there. And my game is acting a little laggy at the moment. Um, oh shoot, one other thing we're going to want to be able to build when we're over there. Go away, I don't want your updates. Is we're going to want to be able to build a fabricator. So we're going to need table coral for that. How much room do we have in our inventory? Just enough for the table coral, okay. So, slice and dice. Hopefully, if we need more table coral, or not table coral, but hopefully if we need more titanium, we'll be able to find it over there by sea base, or super pod number three. Okay, so we're going to the red zone, which is over here, okay. Oh no. It wasn't three, was it? What was it? I think it's 17. Yeah, 17, okay. So 17 is right there. Okay, so I've decided that, I was being honest with you guys, the last few episodes have done all the episodes so far. The game itself, beautiful, exciting, fascinating. Me, I'm probably just a snooze. I'm kind of boring, probably, to you guys. And I apologize for that. Um, I think I've done, if I do it correctly, I've got a fantastic sense of humor. Very entertaining person to watch. Unfortunately, I think I get too absorbed into the game. So, in an effort to make this more entertaining for you, I'm thinking that I'm going to try and take on a new persona for every episode. Let's see here. Um, let's try and build a base right here. I think that'll be fun. Um... So for this episode, I'm going to not explore any caves currently. I'm going to become a Scotsman for your laddies. We'll build ourselves a nice little foundation right there. Aye. Then on that foundation, we'll build a multi-purpose room. Now, does that multi-purpose room, does it give us a way in right away or no? I don't think it do, so we'll have to put on a bulkhead yet too. Okay, so... Let's put this baby on there. We'll put it on right there. Next! We're going to need a source of power, so let's 
go for... Where do we have our bioreactor? There we go. Oh, we need more titanium. Okay. Out we go for more titanium. Let's grab a bit of oxygen real quick before we go searching for that titanium lots. And oh, look, that one long leg. It's a lady car or thing. Oh, all we need is one more titanium. Who wants to be the lucky studio audience member who helps us to build a new foundation? Let's see. Oh, there we go. Are you the one with the titanium? You are! You're our winner! Come on aboard! We will go and give you your prize after we slice this guy up. Hi, you take on a Scotsman? You bitey. Come back here, you lordy. Oh, you know can get me, because I got a knife. And there we go, I just made the ocean a wee bit safer for everyone. But just a wee bit, they're not big threats. So, bioreactor, come on out. Let's... Let's see here, one other thing that we want is we want a fabricator, which we need more titanium for! Come on down! Let's see here. Let's grab some fish for our bioreactor. You'll work. Come on. Come on. Apparently he also wants me for his bioreactor. Nope, you can have that. Oh, that poor eye eye. Um... All right, into the sub after this boomerang. Come on, I got one, ha ha ha. Okay, so there we go, oxygen's back at peak. Now we'll just grab this here spade fish. And uh, yeah, that should be enough to get things started at least. We'll follow him, maybe he'll send us to the titanium that we need. Oh, come on, I clicked on you like three times, lad. What are you? Let's see here. Now we just need to find some titanium in these rocks. Add some copper. That's lead. Let's see where the titanium is. They ever tell you lots about the time that I saved the world from extinction when I rode a dinosaur down the street or right on into uh, Tokyo City. Oh, you want to fight? Aha, I won that round. I, I so totally saved the world from Team Rocket and Devastation when I rode that T-Rex right on into battle. I, we, they were coming in on Brontosauruses and they were just Totally destroying the place, wrecking things up, and oh boy, it was not good, I'll tell you that. Let's see here. One more piece of titanium and we're set. So here I was, riding this 20,000 ton giant T-Rex that was as red as this grass that we're swimming around by. And... Um, Gosh, more copper. So here we are, riding this T-Rex in the battle. And we're giving out our manly, manly battle cries. And everyone was scared of us, I'll tell you that much. I don't care if you don't believe in Mr. Whale. We need some oxygen. So here, fill her up. I got the lights on, we got some air. Hmm. I think we're going to want to grow some fruit trees because those fruit trees those will fill that pocket up pretty gosh darn good. Let's see here, more titanium. Yes, I think we can build our last piece now, lads. Let's give it a go. Uh, here we go. We'll build our 
Ooh, we need more battery juice. Um, I totally read that wrong. We need fiber mesh and a computer chip. I think we got some of those things back at the base. But we'll get this here set up. And for now, well, let's go back to our, well, what we really need is more titanium and fiber mesh. Yeah, let's go back to the other base. Fiber mesh, computer chip, don't hit my car. Man, there's a lot of little biters around here, isn't there? We could be in combat almost as glorious as the time that I rode that dinosaur in the combat and we totally saved the world. Make the fiber mesh we need. Yep, we need to go back to the base, but let's just get out real quick. We'll gather some creep fine. That's more than enough. I bet you we can throw some of this in the bioreactor too, lads. That'll power the station for a nice long time, yeah. I, uh, I love my little car. What do I need to build a moon pool? I know we got the, uh, the upgrade for it. I'm not. The moon pool. Lots of titanium, lubricant, and lead. Okay. Okay. We can... We can get that much titanium. Even if we have to scrounge about the safe shadows for a few hours, we can definitely get that much. I really want to run into the waters, but I don't want to damage my ship. Ah, oh, the sound of that ship. Let's go on out and take a peek. What do we got in our fabricator? Silicone mesh, that's what we need in our repl replicator. Oh, give me my high chip. That's exactly what we need. And some lead. We need to build one of those too. Maybe two of them. Yeah, one should do as far as lads. And we want, we want this for now. That should be good. Yeah. Okay. Let's go back to our base. Build our fabricator and start searching for some more titanium. Or I suppose I could uh, turn on the beacon again. Uh, we want 17. Wait, 17's on. So where are you, 17? Why can't I find you? There you are. Here we go, lads and lassies. Ooh, we're going over to the side. We're... Ooh, that was a bad idea on my part. That, again, was a bad idea on my part. I could just come into this area and steal all that salvage. That'll give us all kinds of titanium. So here I was, riding my bloody red dinosaur down the street into Tokyo, fighting Team Rocket, riding a bunch of brontosauruses. And I'll tell you what, my dino, he dined. He dined well. What happened to my other one? Whatever. So we need our... No. We need our replicator. Which requires titanium, doesn't it? Titanium. We got a table coral sample, don't we? Oh. Well, totally read that one wrong. 
Okay, so we need table coral and we need titanium. We can find this. We can find what we need. Perhaps not here, but we can find it. So, I'm sure you're all dying to hear how this ended. But my dinosaur, he attacked the, the brontosauruses and I jumped off and I took my giant laser sword and together we sliced through that enemy like they were butter. Okay, so we got some titanium. Now we just need some table coral. Table coral. Do you have any table coral growing on your lad? That would be very useful. I that it would. Uh, there's got to be some table coral growing around here somewhere. Almost jumped the moon shadow. Got some salvage. Bingo. There we go. Now we head back to our base, we build a replicator, and it gets dark out. How terrifying is that? And the good news is we're getting closer and closer to a seam off. So yeah, I, here I was, jumping around with my laser sword, slicing down brontosauruses left and right, and my T-Rex, he was just Terminal up part with his teeth and he was eating good hearty meals. I feel like I'm going a little more Russian than Scottish right now and I apologize for that. That was not my intention. Let's go replicate. Right there, I guess. Oh. Okay, so next thing we need is we need to make titanium. So, is that enough for an ingot? No, we need a lot more. What can you make? Copper wire... You know what? I think... We need more parts for the battery charger. We can make a wall locker. Let's go ahead and build one. Build a wall locker. So we can store some of our other stuff in there that we don't really need to be carrying around with us. Let's see here, we don't need to carry you around or you. We got an extra computer chip. What will it take to fabricate a mid pack maker? Apparently, what? Fiber mesh, silver ore, and titanium. So let's go ahead and build it. So I I love doing the Scottish accent because that is the accent that you use for Dwarvish characters. Ooh, it eats up that seaweed pretty fast, doesn't it? Uh huh. Okay, store you. The rest of this is food and a full battery. Alright. Okay, we're going to go search for some salvage. But first, let's fix our boat up. That's nice and shiny. So there's not really much more to tell about my journey I just chopped up brontosauruses with my laser sword and my t-rex ate them ah and I'm thirsty there we go I stabilized that's very important there don't you know okay so now we're just looking for some wreckage you know where it would be a great place to look for wreckage? Besides in here, obviously. Bingo. Let's go and grab some wreckage. 
because I'll take away all the stalkers toys that'll make them happy let's see here I told you they'd be happy yeah he was I just took his whole collection that guy is not happy at all mm -mm. but it's for a greater good you can come swim in my moon pool Let's go for it. Thought there was another piece somewhere in around here. Yeah, there's one more. Okay. Hi. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got my tucker spitting. I'm so sorry for taking all of your stuff, but it's for the greater good, lads. So it's surely you can see that. More copper and more titanium. Excellent. All right, let's go uh, see what we've looted here. See if it's enough to make a moon pool. So we're gonna need something to recharge our power core here pretty quick. In we go. Gotta remember to buy my ship some, bring my ship fish sometimes. Makes it happy. Let's see here. Oh, there we go. First titanium ingot. We need two. <clears throat> How much more titanium do we have? I think we picked up five pieces of salvage, so that should be another two more to go here. And there we go. We got two titanium ingots. Very good. Very good. Okay, now to build that moon pool, let's see here, moon pool, we need lubricant and lead, I think we got that here, don't we? So we got the lead but no lubricant, okay, it's okay, we are very close to the creep vines, they've got what we need for the lubricant, so we'll just go grab that, we'll do a little shopping while we're out. Don't run away from me. You're about to power an entire underwater station. Doesn't that make you feel important? And you, sir, I'm going to eat. Reginald's very nutritious. Grab the quartz while we're here. Grab a wee bit of salt. Let's see if we can nab another boomerang fish. Gotcha. There we go. The, sh the base will eat well today. Okay, not that well though. The base is hungry. Feed the base. How did I not grab you? There we go. Okay. Yeah, we we, we want to go in. Thank you. Honey, I brought you dinner. So, here. Eat up. Yum, yum. Okay. So now, need you to make lubricant it only takes one so we have extra for next time okay 
So now we can go outside. We can build our moon pool. We can build our moon pool. And how much does it cost for a, a tubing? Two titanium. Okay. Let's rotate it. And what good does that do me? Okay. Okay. It's okay. We'll take this apart for now. So you want me to get a Wilson, is that what you're saying, game? Let's... Jerk. Trying to build a moon pool here. Aren't you supposed to spin when I do that? Will you please attach? Oh, there we go. Okay, let's go get into our Seamoth. Good thing we are getting into our Seamoth then. We will drive right on into our new garage. Boom. Upgrade panel. Yes, we need some upgrades for our Seamoth. Okay. What? Only a hunter are at ninety percent. Okay. Yeah, let's eat some food. Are healed up. Okay, so let's get you out. We'll make some more water. We'll cook our Reginald. Here we go. I think what I had was going bad. Okay, right. First, we make our bleach. Then, we make our water. So, we need to get more food for us and more water for the base. Hmm. So, drink it down. Okay, there we go. Um. I mean, I guess we can start moving resources. I can move resources in between the episodes, too. Um, what I really like to build right now is a beacon. Where is an option for... Is that deployable? Beacon, copper, and titanium. Okay, we, we got some of those things. So let's build ourselves a beacon. Can I name the beacon? I'd really like to name the beacon. All right. Let's go and take our little wee pixie inside of that cave system. Yeah, got enough energy. Let's get back to war. Okay, so that's a big chunk of salt right there. Yes. Oh! I'd like to eventually upgrade to a nuclear reactor. Or do you think we'll get enough sun here? Maybe we can do some solar panels too. Yeah. Oh, there's an extensive cave system around here somewhere. There's some salvage. 
don't think this is it. Beautiful brain coral though. No doubt about that. What do you got? Part of a laser cutter. Some salvage. But doesn't look like much of anything of any use to us. Part of a sea moth. Here we go. This looks much more promising. Oh yeah, look how deep this goes. And actually, I'm gonna get out for just a second here. And I'm gonna mark this with our beacon. down into our sea moth. I don't know if I'll be able to go as deep as we were hoping though lots because we're pretty close to our max. Can we at least find a diamond around here somewhere? We'll see what we can find down here. Get your scanner ready, lad. Okay. There is nothing. This. Can I take the battery? No. Totally worth it to nearly get my Seamoth destroyed. Well, maybe there's some diamond around here somewhere, eh? Let's take a peek around. Like, what do we have here? Magnetite. I think there was something that we... No, we don't got that much oxygen. Let's see here. Here's some a shale trunk with lithium. Okay, we well, need diamonds, but we're in the right area. That's for sure. Let's see here, what do we got in this shell truck? <gasps> we got our diamonds, our diamonds. We got our diamonds to build stuff. Sure, let's scan it. Okay. Get back to our sea moth real quick. And... I think for now, since our sea moth really doesn't like being down this far, let's leave off any more exploration just for now. See if we can't figure out how to get out of this place. Oh yeah, I think we're going to be building lots of beacons. Okay. Yeah, now. Well, let's go over here. We'll pick up some more titanium. You know, just some salvage because why not? We need the titanium. Do do. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, we're coming back here. We're cutting your doors open. You're good for some titanium. <laughs> Here we go. We down low quartz. Oh, we can get inside. Have we been inside here? We have not. Some water. Okay, that's good stuff. So, oh, battery charger. That's exactly what we wanted. Okay. So we 
Man, I'm so happy that we stopped here to look at this place and find out that they had another sealed door right there. What's over here? Laser cutter fragment. I feel like there was something else we could pick up. Let's go and take a look around. Yeah, we need the laser cutter. Which we will go. That's a window. How did we get in here? How did we... We came in this way, right? Okay. Is there any other... Here we go. Salvage. Salvage. Inventory is full. Okay. Well, we'll be coming back here anyway. Let's see here. Uh, excuse me? I'll blind ya. Take that. Okay. So there's our beacon. Base is over this way. But, oh, look how beautiful that is. Let's go ahead and park our car. Oh, I love this garage. Okay. So there's a few new things that we need to build into our base. First things first, let's get as much titanium as we can. Give it to me, make it rain titanium. Okay, now what do we need for our laser cutter? Laser cutter, we need two diamonds, battery, titanium, and cave sulfur. We got all that. Do we have all that here? I got two diamonds here. And we'll store some of you. Nope, we need you. Alright. How are you doing on fuel? You're fine. Oh, that's right. We parked our car. I love the moon pool. It's such a fascinating part of this game. Alright, here we go. Back to our original base. We'll get our cave sulfur. We'll make our later cutter. We'll make our way back here, we'll explore those two wrecks, and then we'll call that an episode. But then, we're going back to the Aurora. Oh, so sorry. And once we get to the Aurora, we're going through all those doors we couldn't get through before. I, I wear kilts and eat haggis. I braid my beard so that it makes interesting shapes. And you're all like, how did you get that shape? I'm like, I'm a Scotsman. Let's go in here and show me cave sulfur. Ha, very nice. Let's make ourselves a laser cutter. Okay, so next we're going to grab as much out of here as we can. Star. Okay, I think that's definitely a, a decent grab. Um, parks my car over here. Turn around and hit it right on back. to our secret base underwater. Oh ho. So I think we're gonna to need to make a few preparations, which I'll do off screen for our our journey back to the Aurora. We're gonna obviously need some more food, some more water. I'll take care of gathering that. 
we'll get some more bleach, uh, some salt. We'll, we'll make bleach from the salt and from the table coral. Uh, we'll grab some of these fish. At one point we do want to go back and get some more of that fruit. All right, let's park the car. So smooth. All right, we'll drop off a full load of stuff into our locker. We'll build another locker, which is under this wall. Actually, before we do that, copper wire wiring kit. So we need silver and copper. Okay, we can get that. Why is my light blinking? Okay. What's your emergency? Well, maybe we'll go check out Life Pot 12 before we go to the Aurora as well. But that's certainly not going to be this episode. I told you we'll go explore those two pieces of wreckage. And that's what we'll do. I think one of them was over here, close to our beacon. There we go, there's some wreckage. We'll cut some doors open. We'll scan that bioreactor. There we go, that's close enough. So get your scanner out first. Okay, got some more titanium, which is a very useful and versatile substance. Okay. Cut open our that door. That's really bright. We're halfway through the door. And we're in. All right. In we go. And what do we have here for our scanner? Nothing scannable, really. Okay, we've already gotten into this door through the other side, so we'll cut open this door and see what we got inside. And hopefully, it's something good. Okay. I already got a mobile vehicle bay. Yeah. Oh, modification station. That is very important. We almost have that completed. Uh, mobile bay. I already got that. We'll take it for the titanium. Uh, what else do we have here? I want that picture. Don't know why, but I do. Modification station. Come on, scan it. Scan it. Oh, battery's dead. All right, let's head back to the Seamoth, and then we'll figure out some way to get the new battery in you. Okay, so who is not using the battery right now? You're not, okay. to get that battery charger built. Let's see. 
Alright, give me the modification station. There we go. And data box. Lightweight, high capacity tank. Ooh, that sounds important. Okay. I think that'll do it for here for now. So, let's head to the other wreckage, which is over by our bi I know you weren't just attacking my car. I know you weren't. Yeah, that's what you get when you attack me. Sorry, that's what you get when you attack me. Okay, so... That's 12. Oh, we cannot go down that deep yet. We are not going to life pod 12 before we go to the Aurora. So next episode will be Return to the Aurora. But we got some stuff to do in between then and now. I gotta find some silver. Gotta build a battery charger. Charge up some batteries. Get all of our equipment. Get some food. And then we will go on an adventure to the Aurora. I think we've... Oh, I'm sorry. Yikes. Lovely place I picked. Some very grouchy neighbors we got here. I do want to scan that. We should build a scanner room. Very useful. As a matter of fact, you're not looking so hard. Oh, you're fifty percent. You're fine for now. We'll get you fixed up in between episodes too. We'll take you into the shop. It's just like a spa day for chips. Okay, scanners out. Bioreactor fragment. Very useful that. Yeah, we're... Oh, some titanium just sitting here. Okay, let's look for ways on board this ship for now. Nothing here. Well, oh, come on, something this big's got to have a door runner somewhere, right? Not. Maybe you are just a big hunk of metal. Can I turn you into titanium? Wow, this is just one gigantic piece of a ship that I can't get into. No, can't cut it. Okay, well, I don't think we can get into this part of the ship. So we are going to end the episode off here. When you get back, we'll be restocked, ready to go, powered up, fixed up. So I do want to thank you again for coming and joining me on another episode here of Subnautica, B BZ People. This has been another episode with Scottish Borg. Uh... Don't forget to tape your witnesses and also don't forget we are Bork and Zim Gaming. We are professional amateurs. Bye now. For nine.